Hi everyone, this is Amy with Buddy Punch. In this video, I'll show you how to enable time off accruals and how to set up your first accrual rule. Let's start by turning on the accrual feature. Click on settings, then time off. Now, check the box that says allow employee time off accrual and then click save. Now that we've enabled accruals, you can manually adjust time off balances with an accrual entry or you can create accrual rules to apply hours automatically moving forward. To create an accrual rule, we'll first need a time off earning code. To create a new code, click add a new time off earning code. Give it a name, we'll call ours new code and an abbreviation like NC. Make sure included in time off accrual is checked. You can also mark it as paid or unpaid and decide if new employees can go into the negative. Set your max hours Choose whether hours carry over to the next year or reset on a certain date. You then have the choice to assign the code to all your employees or you can select which employee you'd like to have access to the code. Once you are finished, click save. Now that we have our time off code, let's create the accrual rule. Start by clicking add new time off accrual rule. Give the rule a name. We'll go with new rule. Next, choose how often employees earn time. Is it by pay period? the hours worked or yearly. We'll choose pay period for this example. Now pick the time off type. Let's go with the code we created earlier, new code. Remember, only codes marked for accrual will show here. Then enter the number of hours earned, say two hours per period. Select the desired individual employees or click to apply to all current and future employees. Don't forget to click save. That's it. Buddy Punch makes managing time off accruals simple and flexible. Thanks for watching and have a great day.